Hi folks, welcome back to the Horde. About 10, 15, 5, 6, Monday, 53 degrees. Feels a little warmer than that outside, but I've been in the sun. Anyway, been a sunny start so far to the day. Here we are. Anyway, I was asked um, with one of the comments um, how my uh, TRX 300's feeling. Well, the TRX 300 was drafted into uh, tow truck mode this morning. Here she is. Um, I had to drag this thing up here. She was sitting out in the driveway, obviously, from the unload. So I had to pull it up here. Just a quick trick for towing with these things. If you're tr towing something disabled, um, I find, obviously, that's not wearing a front tire there. So what I find uh, doing, if I grab high on the bike that's doing the towing and grab low on the bike that you want to tow, and you keep the rope fairly short, that you, you'll you'll lift the front end up, and you could you can drag things around with it. Um, obviously, as I have done here. Um, what am I? Uh, by the way, so this is the the 300 I was asked about. Obviously, she's running well. Um, she's got her own spot that's easy to get her in and out of. I mean, obviously, I locked this shed. I don't leave the keys in it. Um, and my buddy Chuck patrols my property regularly at gunpoint. This is, by the way, what it is, if anybody cares. I paid a lot of money for this thing back in the day. Um, I bought it used. When did I buy it? Like 2000, I guess. Um, yeah, and I, I, once again, I paid 2001, something like that. I paid like uh, 3500, 3800 with tax and everything else. It was right around 4000 bucks. It was a lot of, it was a lot of money back then. It was, uh, it was young, barely used. These are still the original tires. So, you can tell it, it doesn't it doesn't have all that many miles on it. I try to take halfway decent care of it. I mean, I keep the oil changed. I put a new battery in it all the time. I, um, I don't submerge it. Some, of these, some people take these things into the water, up to the seat. Um, I got $4,000 sitting in this thing. I won't do that. I mean, I might take one of these other rats that I only have a few hundred involved in. Uh, and, and take it in water um, up to the seat, but uh, four thousand, I, I can't afford. Well, I'm, I can't afford to replace it. So, I mean, if anything, ha you know, I, I, I want to enjoy um, one heck of a stream crossing, uh, and uh, I, I just, I can't, I can't risk losing the bike. It, it'd be, you, you know, I wouldn't get another one. I, I, I couldn't squeeze that kind of. Uh, money out of the family budget and the wife to uh, to replace it so it, it would be lost um, but once again if one of these other guys went in the stream you know maybe old Smokey here and you, you know flipped over and you, you know had a bad day not that I would be happy about that but you, you know that would be a lot more amusing to lose a hundred and sixty six dollar bike compared to a four thousand dollar bike um, anyway, I gotta go get the um, the 185 and move it up, get it out of the way. So just untying, you can see how she's lowering herself down. You know, you always find out about things kind of after you own them. This tire's uh, shot. You can see the cracking on the bottom. I mean, the rim might be helpful but the tires done. The back tires do look good, so I did okay. For $200, this is a nice, this is a really excellent parts bike. Um, I, I just shouldn't delude myself that it's going to be anything other than that, and, and then it was a good investment. 
this guy I'm still waiting for the stator to come in on uh, then I could put it together this guy um, I gotta basically drag this one out maybe I should not screw around and get that done too um, I gotta drag this guy out uh, this is the guy with the rear end hopefully she rolls I think it does yeah it seems to roll so this is the one I gotta pull the rear end out of to put in to put in that guy I mean I got the key switch I get everything for this I mean you can see all the plastics here um, the seat the seats all here so for, for that guy I got everything this one as I recall had a tranny problem so um, yeah that's gonna end up God, I still got this engine torn apart in the basement. I should either put that engine back together again and put on it or, or hack one of these other engines on it and stop screwing around. This guy, this guy, I was, um, it's an electric, obviously. See the electric here. What I was going to do with this guy, you, you know, with all my spare time, I was going to extend the frame because it's a, it's a bit short, but I was going to extend the frame and um, put a real a bigger engine on it. It has no front suspension at all. It's got that little shock thing in the back. Part of extending the frame, um, what I could do with it is is perhaps give it a little more than, uh, what do I got, four inches of travel there. Yeah, but anyway, I was going to extend the frame and put a real engine on it. I don't know, right, with all my spare time. All right, folks, live, love, and have a great time. We'll catch you on the next episode of The Horde. Um, I'll video whatever the heck I get into. Um, I'm having a lot of uh, trouble with uh, space right now. I'm, uh, I'm dying for lack of space, and I'm, um, I'm dying of, uh, well, I have no place to work on anything because uh, literally my, uh, my space is all, all taken up. So um, I got to uh, I got to move some stuff around and get things in better places. I mean, like dumb things. This guy, the one closest to me, does not run. The 200s does run. So whenever I want to take the 200s out, I got a jackass first the big quad out, which I don't mind because normally it goes out to play at the same time. But then I got to jackass this one out to get the 200s out. So then the 200S don't get the miles that you get, and the tires go flat, and you, you know, then it's a job to, to use it. So I also got to rethink uh, my storage stuff here and get a little more efficient. All right, folks, once again, we'll catch on the next episode of The Horde. Uh, till then, um, try not to buy more bikes than you could store. Obviously, uh, they do be, you know, in the beginning they're fun, and then they become too many. All right, thanks.